From the Opoco Coast Studios in Oklahoma City, this is an OU update with Ryan Aber. I'm Jenny Carlson. Ryan, not a ton of drama in that <laughs> season opener against La Tech, but probably the most interesting moment of the game was the Jordan Evans targeting call and Bob Stoops saying uh, this week that he's still seeking some clarification from the Big 12. What exactly is he seeking there? Well, on, on the play, Cody Sokol, the Louisiana Tech quarterback, uh, dives really after Jordan Evans had started initiating the action of going for the tackle. He didn't get fully launched but came up on, on one foot and, and there was helmet-to-helmet contact. I think pretty clearly by the rule uh, the call was right, but I think they want to know what to tell their guys to try to prevent this when you can in the future. And uh, it's just one of those, those tough areas uh, with this new targeting rule that came out last year that sometimes the intent clearly isn't there, but by the letter of the rule, the ejection was, was uh, by the book. Well, and it didn't look like he was trying to do anything malicious, but the hit was the hit and it was what it was. So what, what do you feel like the Big 12 may tell Bob Stoops to then tell his guys that might alleviate some of this in the future. Well, I think the, the biggest thing is just the, the players have to always be aware of what, what's going on on the other side. They have to be able to react quickly uh, when a quarterback, especially a quarterback, goes down. He was in the process of a slide, giving himself up for the play, and then uh, there was the contact. Now, like I said, there was, I don't think there was any intent on Jordan Evans' part to – to put a hit on him like that, it just through the course of the action happened. But I think it's one of those things, it's going to be tough for them to tell them much. But uh, as Zach Sanchez said yesterday, they, they have to be able to, to make those adjustments with the rules the way they are. Head up, wrap up. That's sort of yeah. what I think about. Get your head up. They've talked a lot about that with tackling, but also arms up to wrap up. I didn't see that from Jordan Evans either. Is that maybe one nuance out there? Yeah, absolutely. You have to have to get him uh, wrapped up. He was starting to, to move his hands forward, but clearly led with the helmet there and it's a uh, it, it's a tough deal like I said we we saw it uh, last year Gabe Lynn was was ejected uh, initially for a call in this Tulsa game uh, but and then that was overturned the penalty stood but uh, this year uh, all of them are being reviewed and the, and the penalty can be overturned as well but but this one by the letter of the law was a targeting call all right thanks Ryan sure stay with the best coverage team anywhere at newsok.com and every day in the Oklahoma